What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. So Apple has released a new version of iOS 14 and that is going to be, let me go ahead and jump in here, 14.4.1. This is very interesting if you ask me. Um, as it's something that needed to be patched immediately, it wasn't something they could wait for in the iOS 14.5 beta. So to me, it seems pretty critical that Apple pushed out this update. Now, um, if you guys do not care about jailbreaking, you don't care about jailbreaking one bit, of course, go ahead and update. Uh, it'll only improve security on your device. If you guys care about jailbreaking and you want to jailbreak, do not update to this version of iOS. Do not update. If you're on 14.4, stay there. Obviously, if you guys are on older 14 versions and you're jailbroken, uh, I would definitely say don't update either because you will lose your jailbreak essentially. But um, the reason why I say this, now if we go ahead and jump into GitHub. So if you guys remember, uh, the exploit used for the 14.0 through 14.3 jailbreak, the exploit is called Secuta Verosa. This was released by Modern Poner. Now I covered this I covered this way back um, when the exploit was released. But if we scroll down on the GitHub page here, I'll leave a link for this in the description if you guys want to see it yourself as well. Um, but I did mention this in a follow-up video, the PAC bypass. Now, if you read this, for the moment, we have a brand new technique to bypass PAC, but we decided not to include such critical stuff here. So to me, that's saying this is more of a critical bug than, you know the initial uh, exploit release. So maybe we'll post a PAC bypass along with iOS 14.5 exploit. This is in progress. We may publish 14.5 exploit after Apple patches it. Now I'm just kind of putting two things together here, guys. I'm just making an educated guess, but this could be the bug that Apple just patched. And fingers crossed, if this is the bug that Apple just patched, maybe Modern Poner will release it. Thus, we will have a 14.4 jailbreak, which would be amazing. Like I said, I'm only guessing, guys, I have no other information than this GitHub page and the update in settings. That's all I'm going off of. But like I said, if you guys want a jailbreak, always stay at the lowest firmware possible. That is always the best thing you can do. Um, if you guys don't want a jailbreak, of course, go ahead and update to 14.4.1. It's only going to be more secure than 14.4. Um, and that's all I got for you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this jailbreak update video. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.